was it like the first time you went back on camera? It was, it was interesting. <laughs> I actually shot um, a TLC series out in India. And I did, I did um, do a couple of editorial, um, I did an editorial actually for Vogue India, uh, in which I was still, I was still pleasantly plump, you could say, bald, okay. and I felt beautiful. I felt so supported. I felt that, you know, again, it was very, very naked, but it was so honest. And that's what I've been striving for. You know, the irony is as an actor, that's somewhat what you strive for, right? In your performances, you're striving for truth and honesty. And I want to find the, you know, the kernel of, of, you know, humanity in this character and in this moment. And when you can't find it in yourself, it becomes, again, such a disconnect between, again, sort of the red carpet image that we're expected to portray and then what you are expected to do as an actor to I, find truth was it harder to get work and I only say this because a cancer patient won't get insured even on small films it's hard to get them insured are you kidding me this is another thing that I love talking about it's it's crazy even it's crazy on an independent film right? so now I have a pre-existing condition yeah thank you very much <laughs> thanks a lot you know and um, and wow that has absolutely opened up an entirely new world um, and uh, yeah in Canada especially and I've of course have mainly acted in indie films uh, what we need to do as an actor is you get insured before you, um, you know, every, every cast member has to get a particular kind of insurance. Yeah. And often, um, obviously, the premiums will go up the roof when they find out that you have a pre-existing condition. So sometimes with a particular production where the budget is really tight, it's like, sorry, we're not sure that we can hire you. So this is obviously very, it's been a very eye-opening um, period of my life. But having said that, I have gotten so much support, and I'm back on my feet and, um, and reading scripts and looking for the next meaty role after Top Chef Canada, right. after I've sunk my teeth into <laughs> Top Chef Canada. And, um, and I have been getting, um, you know, again, incredible support from the community. But I, I, I just think it's so important to just be honest and talk about these things and share our human experiences.